Let's get some background on this from CBS News legal analyst Lisa Bloom. Good morning, Lisa. Good morning, Harry. So let's talk about this Yucatel character who flies to California to meet with your mother. She denies everything, then they have meetings, and then she was going to hold a, a press conference and then cancels the press conference. We don't want you to violate any mother-daughter uh, privileges <laughs> here. But what can you tell, what, is, what insight can you help us with? Well, my mother has obligations of confidentiality to her client, and so she's not talking to the press. But I did work with her side by side as an attorney for nine years in her law firm. I know exactly how she operates. And I don't have any confidenti confidentiality obligations here, so I can piece all of this together for you, okay. Harry. We know that paparazzi caught Gloria Allred leaving uh, Tiger Woods' attorney's offices on Monday night. That has to mean that they were engaging in negotiations. Paparazzi then caught her leaving Rachel Yucatel's hotel on Wednesday night after midnight, and at 7 a.m. the press conference was canceled. Now, I know how my mother operates. That had to mean that negotiations were going on. Negotiations probably broke down on Tuesday. Mm -hmm. That's why she scheduled the press conference, where Rachel was probably going to tell all to the world. And that press conference being canceled, Yesterday at the last minute, Harry, I have never in all of my mother's career of over 30 years known her to cancel a press conference. That can only mean one thing. As we say in the law, Mr. Green has arrived. There has to have been a confidential settlement. Tiger Woods' camp, of course, would want confidentiality mm -hmm. as to not only the amount of the settlement, but a promise from Rachel never to talk about her relationship with him. And I would estimate that had to be in a very significant amount for my mother to cancel that press conference. I would estimate at least a million dollars, probably well in excess of a million dollars, given the amounts that are flying around in this case as to his wife and as to the other women. Right. So at least as far as this is concerned, from your perspective, does this seem done? It has to be a done deal. She would never have canceled the press conference merely based on a promise or merely based on ongoing negotiations. They probably went on all through the night, uh, and I would assume she only canceled that press conference once there was a deal in place, once Mr. Green arrived. Wow. Mr. Green, uh, when he speaks, people listen. <laughs> there you go. Lisa Bloom, thank well, you. Very good. What were you going to say? Very quick. Uh, no, I was going to say Tiger Woods is throwing a lot of money around in this case, reportedly, as to his wife and now as to Rachel Yucatel. It's the only possible conclusion. Lisa Bloom, thanks a lot for getting up early for us on the West Coast. Do appreciate it. My pleasure. Right. Thank you.